Well, you have heard it from Chris, Riley, Mike, Lisa, and Katie. It has been a roller coaster of a winter. Cold, then warm, then cold again. So why are there so many temperature swings this season? Susan Elizabeth Littlefield headed outside for tonight's Good Question. There have been ups. And there have been downs. Yeah, we felt like we were on a roller coaster. Have you noticed that? Absolutely, and that was the only saving grace of the, that it was only for a couple days, and then we'd have a heat wave, a heat wave. I can take this. It's like, yeah, yeah it was below freezing for a few days, then it would come up, and then mm -hmm. I, that's kind of, I, I can manage, that can, I can manage. The cold days have been followed by warm ones, like this. The sun's actually hot today, so um, I don't know, it feels kind of like rejoicing in a way. It almost feels like spring today in a way. Only in Minnesota does 40 feel like 80, right? right? But now more cold is coming. Another example of this winter's whiplash pace. It feels like we've been on a roller coaster, have yes. we? Absolutely. The assistant Minnesota State climatologist explained why. We've had 12 Alberta clippers at least uh, since the end of December. So every time one of those comes through, there's a cold front with each clipper and we have warm air coming up ahead of it, just like today, out ahead of a clipper and then behind the clipper, get the cold air. So what this is. Other years have been more stable. This graph shows this January. It's, it's cold as it goes up and then uh, the clipper comes through, so it goes up and down, up and down, just like a roller coaster. And this is the last recorded January, 2020. This would be just that, that you know, kitty coaster. Kitty coaster, yes, yes. Our temp swing this January was 59 degrees. In 2021, it was only 38 degrees. All these clippers, he says, not only cause swings, they cause quick and dry snowfalls. You know, I kind of like this texture. <laughs> Yeah, can't make snowballs tougher. out of it, but uh, for snow angels, it's pretty good. <laughs> Hypothesis, prove it. And that's what we've all learned this winter. Power through the valleys and savor the peaks. In St. Paul. We've got like the perfect snow angel. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO, 4 News. Uh, also of note, when it comes to temperature, this January was the first below average month in nearly a year. And it was the sixth sunniest January on record. Have a good question? Share it with us anytime by clicking the submission link on WCCO.com.